Not bad at all. Yeah. Your form's looking good. <laughs> I knew you could do it. You've got this. Come on. Not bad yeah. at all. <sighs> Not bad. There you are. I've been looking for you two. So Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good and that you should swing by her shop when you're done here. Got it? I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Coliseum. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic, but there's always action if you want to get a piece. Congratulations on the win! You know, tonight's tournament is going down in history. Watching you win was so inspiring! It made me want to fight, too! Aerith, you were amazing! There's never been a female champion before! Congratulations on winning the tournament. You're an impressive fighter. I know that you'll be a great influence on my Johnny. Why, you might even end up having a friendly rivalry. You can spur each other to greater heights. I can see it. You two will become great friends. The best of friends. You're here. Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around, comes around. And in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm going to put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? All right, then. Let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. 
This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Eric, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch! Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. That I told you. No peeking. See the sign out front? All I got is materia. Thanks, buddy. for anything in particular today. Please, feel free to look around. Until I... Welcome to Wall Market's premier weapon shop. Do come again.
If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. gather vital information for my research. <laughs> what happened? Aren't you a curious cat, walking dark alleys? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once. Accommodations. Have a safe trip. about you. 
too, but this place sure is a lot weirder than I thought it would be. So, where are the shady areas? Mm. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? said you'd be swinging by. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys' night out in Wall Market? Uh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all her idea. I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. But when it comes to damn near anything else, I can't help but have my doubts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizons, neither. Seeking new experiences. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect you while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. What do you say? You game? Huh. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight, Mr. Merton. You have yourself a grand time tonight. I bought the same disc twice. Uh, excuse me, sir. If you like, you can have it. Even if you love the artist, you don't need more than one copy. I just need to wait here a little longer. She ought to be out soon. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've got some business. There's a restaurant. You can believe it. My apologies, sir. We are still preparing for our next show.
Welcome. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been hearing about. I need you to help me out with my dad. His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. Could you bring him back here? He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkard's. <laughs> Just over there. caught me up on everything. He said you're gonna go rescue Tifa. And to do that, you're trying to learn all about Walmart. Bro, I know this town like the back of my hand, so I can answer all of your questions. Now, let's go knock this one out. The bar is this way, Cloud. Drunkards, here we come. Uh, are we even allowed to walk through the door? I have just one. The more you eat, the this better This is the Drunkards' Den, the Chocobo best place in popcorn. Walmart to drink away your problems. It's mostly the same folks every night, so... Well, you can't just waltz in there uninvited. Listen, this I'm is my for dad. this kind of... It speaks to me. Hey, wait for me! Hey, old dude! Huh? Son, is that you? Did you always look so... moronic? Come right back at you! Yeah, whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back! Not ever! My life is ruined! It's over! Kill me now! Come on, there's no need to talk like that, old dude. I'll help you out with whatever you need. Really? Oh, thank you, son! See, I made this bet with the Materia Merchant. A sure thing, but then I lost! And so I had no choice but to steal my heart and surrender my precious inspiration! Your precious inspir... who with the what now? Inspiration! <laughs> Without it, there's simply no point in me ever going back to the store. Got it. I mean, I don't got it. But I just need to get your inspiration back, right? Whatever the hell that is. Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you gonna go with your friend? <sighs> Drinks are on me. I don't even really know how people use materia. They're just like huge orbs of something. Hey, wait for me! <laughs> so this is it, huh? And what do you two want? Uh, uh, I'm here for the precious inspiration you took from the old dude. Inspiration? Oh, that thing. But I didn't take it. I want it fair and square. It's mine by rights now. Well, that's true. But I tell you what. I'll consider giving it back in exchange for it. A favor. Uh, what you need? Something only real men can deliver. Uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the end. You know what. You know. No, I don't think I... Wait. The saw. The sauce? Stop saying the sauce. Anyway, good luck. The time has come for me to wield my powers of assessment. I can feel it. Oh, I can feel it. I'm in for one wild ride. I'm gonna see some big... Just, that's it. 
That's the one. It looks like a regular old vending machine, right? But wait. <laughs> you ready for this? All right. This particular model has secret buttons. Where? Well, I can't tell you. It's a secret. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expertise. Like, grab it and whip it out. And then you'll be able to see everything. I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. Whoa, look at you, bro. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. Come on, bro. You know there are more hidden buttons waiting to be pushed. Oh, so this is the sauce. Neato. It's time. The last button. The sauce! Put it away! Put it away before someone sees you! No one can know that we have it! You're the grand prize winner! Have a special prize! <laughs> Don't scare me like that! Whatever! We got what we came here for! Let's get out of here and head to the Materia guy! It's you two. It's time, bro. The sauce. Could it be? Oh, it is. The sauce. The sauce. Whoa. Oh, never thought I'd live to see the day. It's just sauce. No big deal. Don't sell yourself short. This is only given to one who is truly a man among men. Huh. I know. Damn, bro! That's why you're such an awesome dude! Oh, right. Hate to break it to you, but that thing you were looking for? Not here. It's long, long gone. You shitting me? Nope. Sorry. As I recall, the guy who runs the restaurant should have it. Ugh! Well, I guess we know where we're headed next. Come on, bro! Well, that's that. Time to polish the old orbs. Give them a spit shine so they positively sparkle. Hey, if you're done here, then get going already. Restaurant up next, huh? Getting kind of hungry, actually. I don't know. I think it's coming from over there. Nope. Stay focused. Man, I like seriously don't know which one to get. I'm a decisive guy, but when it comes to food, it's a different story. Hey, wait for me! Welcome! Feel free to take any open seats. Sorry, we're not here to eat. The Materia guy gave you something, yeah? We want it. Materia guy? Oh, you hear about that? I'm surprised. Didn't take you for the type. Let me ask you something. Either of you know anything about cooking? Nope, never cooked once. That's too bad. For some reason, my food doesn't taste nearly as good as it used to. I was hoping one of you two might be able to help me figure it out. I've narrowed it down to the fridge, the stove, or the power supply, but I'm not sure what's to blame. Man, I seriously have no idea what it could be. This sucks.
I've got it. The problem is, the heat's not high enough. Oh? Know a little something about fire, do you? Okay, then. Let me try turning it on to see if you're right. Well, would you look at that? Works fine. Here, eat up. Man, this looks great. seemed to be enjoying the meal, so I wanted to ask him what he thought. Maybe next time. Anyway, thanks for your help. Oh, and here's a voucher with my apologies. Get the poor guy some medicine, will you? Drugs. I need all the drugs right now. Get your delicious material pops oh, God, right here. Yes, right here. Yours? Well... Oh, that about you you got there? Should have said something sooner. Come on in. What is it with today? People are dropping like flies. Besides this dumbass? Ah, loads of them. I got enough outstanding orders to fill a book. I was about to leave and make some deliveries, but... I'm gonna hurl. Eh, I can't very well leave him alone now, can I? Hey, you're not doing much. Maybe you can deliver that medicine for me. You're what? Military or something, right? Then you must know a thing or two about dealing with the sick and injured. You're a lifesaver. Literally. So, let me see. What needs delivery? Here. Need you to deliver this to someone. You'll probably find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere, but make sure you check his symptoms before giving him meds. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare anyone try and deny it. I dare. You are wrong, sir. Folia may be new, but she is clearly the best.
This is full up too. Hold it. Best to steer clear of this alley. You may not like the people you find down here, and they may not like you. Just over there? You're not still wasting your gill at the Honeybee Inn, are you? <laughs> you bet I am! Found me a secret route in, one nobody don't know about. Only trouble is, it's filled with drunks and garbage. You think? He's fine, just drunk. Like the rest of them. Am I right? <sighs> that rotten. You should smell. I'm so through. It'll never wash off. Uh, don't know who you are, but be a pal and do something about this smell. Sorry, can't help you. Uh, that rotten, putrid smell. I'm so through. It'll never wash off. Uh, don't know who you are, but be a pal and do something about this smell. Sorry. Can't help you. That candy that comes with the summoning materia ice cream. guess where a sick person would end up? I'd say the toy. Start by checking those. Maybe ones in the shops nearby?
people are watching. Look, a Type 60 tank and rocket launchers in charge. Poison, I tell you. The sick son of a bitch puts poison in his food. I've got meds. Let me take a look at you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you saved my life. Here. It's not much, but it's yours. No. Oh. I'm grateful for your help, but do you think a guy could get a little privacy? Probably head back. Looking house, right? And it was all like trying to kill him. But then Cloud was all like, bam, bam, boom. Your friend fought a house. A house? Oh, hey, welcome back, bro. Better already? Yeah, now he won't shut up. Anyway, how'd the deliveries go? I did about as much as I could. Thanks for the help. Great work. Anyway, I promise to be worth your while. Here. I got something you're definitely gonna like. What is it? Well, it belonged to the owner of the clothing store first. Heard from the cook that you boys been running all over town looking for this. Am I right? Wait, we have? Hold up. What were we doing before all this? Oh shit! The inspiration! Bingo! You see, all us Walmart entrepreneurs go way back. We get together for a game every night, bet all kinds of stuff. This found its way into the pool and eventually into my possession, and now it's yours, because, hey, why the hell not? It's a VIP card, highly coveted and extremely rare. They're only given to a select few. Not having it is gonna do you much good, but... Holy mother of... No way! Bro, we gotta get to the honey... Er, I, I, I mean, drunkards on the double! Tell the old man I said hi! Come on, come on, come on! I gotta know! So hey, old dude, oh, we're back! Huh? Who are you? You're no son of mine, I think. Special delivery, just for you. Oh, my inspiration! You've returned to me at long last! Yo, is that what I think it is? Oh, you bet it is, and it was hard won! I sew dresses day and night for those ladies until I got what I was after. A honeybee in VIP card! I knew it! Now make way for the VIP, boys. I don't want to keep my ladies waiting any longer. But first, I should pick up a gift dress. 
Lead the way, old dude. We are coming. Thanks for bringing him back. Can't imagine what you went through. Here, you earned it. Hey, you're coming, right, bro? Get ready for a real Walmart in education. I'm done with this. You, you can do whatever the hell you want. I get it, bro. You're scared. It's only natural for people to fear the unknown. Uh. It's a pity you're not gonna join us, but I swear to you, bro, as an aspiring wall market connoisseur, I'm gonna go in there and get as much inspiration as I can handle for you, bro. For you. Because, Cloud, you are my one true bro. Honeybee in, here I come! Inspiration, here I come! <sighs> Perfect example of how age has absolutely nothing to do with maturity. Couldn't agree more. show up. Thanks for coming, and welcome to our humble training hall. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Wanna try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little thing. I could snap him like a twig. Now, now. I wouldn't judge this one by his muscle mass. What do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So, you up for a round? Ha! You're taking me on? You look like a dried up old terpsichol left out in the sun. You got no idea what you're getting into, little man. All right, enough talk. We'll settle this the tried and true traditional way. A squat off. Now, let's all see what you've got. You ready to do this? to judge people by their build. That and your overtrained ego are the main reasons you lost to our bold challenger here. Thanks for helping me teach my boys a valuable lesson. And sorry for dragging you into it. Cloud, we're all one big family here at this gym. And now you're part of it. If you're ever up for training, our doors are always open to you. Let's work together to maintain healthy minds and bodies. Should probably go see Sam again. 
If you're ever in the mood for another workout, just talk to Jay or Ronnie. You want to go, do ya? All right then, bring it on! Are you ready for this? So, tell me, what'd you see in our little enclave of sand and debauchery? Bet it was an eye-opening experience. Nothing I haven't seen before. That it for jobs? Not exactly. I got one more favor to ask. You want to get teeth out, right? What's your angle? <laughs> Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see. Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see. So, where are the shades? Huh? Mm -hmm. There it is. Oh. Oh.
We've been waiting for you, champ. Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give them a show. Lovers of bloodshed and mayhem, your favorite champion, Cloud, is back in the ring. Right now, this boy may be hot, hot, hot. But look out, folks, because these dynamite challengers may just blow the champ clean off his throne. I hope you brought shades because you're about to see some fireworks. Fighters, begin! than the guns he's packing. Nice going, champ. You were in fine form today. Here's your cut. You earned it. Not here for the cash. Tell me about Tifa. Ah, Tifa. She's something of a bombshell herself, huh? Girl keeps in shape. Boy, does it show. Hey. Just making an observation, that's all. Anyway, seems like you're serious about getting the poor girl out of her predicament. I could tell easy enough by the way you fought back there. Cut to the chase. Well, you helping or not? Never said I would. Opposite, even. Getting mixed up in other people's business isn't my way. Plus, as you are now, I reckon you could ride to her rescue without anybody's help. And that's the truth. You've changed since you first rolled into this here town. For the better. 
At any rate, I've said all I'm gonna say. Your lady friend ought to be done changing by now, am I right? She ain't no Tifa, but she is a firecracker. Keep her waiting too long and she might just blow up in your face. Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight?
stay. Come back anytime you want to fight. 